Hello, Sagittarius. Welcome to Sidekick Tarot. I'm Ryan, and thank you for being here. This is going to be a general reading for who you may be dealing with and what they're up to. Or if you're interested in more tarot readings after this, go ahead and check out my wife's channel, the Val 33 Tarot, which is brief you as well. Thank you. I'll be starting by pulling their current or overall energy. And then we'll be going into clarifiers. Okay, I'll get the cards out first, and then I'll begin. Interesting. I'm a little curious on this. Um, but jumping into the Sagittarius, what they're showing me right away, they definitely are in some type of position of success or status. They've done pretty well for themselves, but I do see that they got something kind of heavily on their mind that they're thinking about wanting to do, wanting to change, wanting to move towards. And it seems to be some sort of closure, but I feel like they're definitely working through a couple different things. Um, there's something sort of thought process or train of thoughts they are kind of closing out and being done with they're accepting this they're leaning into it they are also making small kind of incremental steps towards something now whatever this closure is i'm not too sure what's going on um i kind of feel like they themselves are aware and they know that something needs to be done with which is what they're doing is they're closing it out because immediately following this closure they're showing me that there is quite a bit of emotional disappointment here um, I kind of feel like maybe they didn't want to close this out or be done with something, but they did. And now moving forward, they're having to address and acknowledge their emotions to kind of bring everything back to balance, um, which they are doing because they do show up quite heavily emotionally invested and interested in the situation. At the same time, after this closure takes place, they're also showing me that they know they have to come up with some sort of plan or possible strategy, but they're kind of refusing to do that. I'm not too sure if it's an energy of consciously refusing to do this, or they just don't, in a sense, have any clue what to do. But overall, I kind of feel like it's an energy of maybe they're just not quite ready to make a plan or just jump into action to make a plan because they don't have some sort of vision yet. And that is what they're working on putting together for themselves. Okay. So they're kind of saying they don't want to get ahead of themselves. Okay. Let's go ahead and jump into clarifiers and see what we can find. Yeah, it, mm, goodness. It almost feels like something regarding their work or their career that they're just no longer emotionally interested in. This is fascinating. It's an energy of they're just slowly losing that interest, slowly losing that, in, uh, geez, that emotional investment too. Um, yeah, they're having to come up with something quick. They're definitely surrendering to whatever this is that they're wanting to walk away from. At the same time, it's an energy of... Yes, they understand this, and they know that they're very quickly they're having to kind of come up with some sort of strategy as to what to do. I'm going to say after this. Yeah, this is difficult. This is difficult. They're, they're kind of saying they got a lot on their plate, a lot on their shoulders to take care of. Um, and that's why, geez, geez, geez. A little bit besides themselves as to their thinking and their emotions, but they're, they're kind of showing, how do I say this? Um, it feels as if they're going through the motions without the um, emotions. They're just going through the actions of this. They're like, well, they know they're they know they're kind of checking out. Um, at the same time, they have to kind of complete something too. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fascinating. They're saying by closing something out or just being done with something, this is somehow kind of aiding them in finding their truth or living their truth or realizing their truth. Okay. 
It must have been a good closure for them at the same time. Um, ooh, yeah. Difficult. That is difficult. Closure brings the truth, but also it brings pain. It brings... That's fascinating. Closure brings the truth, but it also brings pain, disappointment, as well as perspective. It's almost like something needed to be done with or closed out for them to be able to see something about themselves or about the situation that they're in. I'm not too sure. Whoa. Oh, yeah. They are... They're definitely thinking about taking some time to themselves. This is an energy of they're kind of like, they're wanting to do their thing, but they're also wanting to be left alone a little bit. Um, even though they do have so much emotional interest and investment in things moving forward as well, I kind of feel like they are in the process of healing themselves, which is bringing those emotions back. At the same time, it's an energy of now that they've kind of healed and dealt with all this, they're ultimately saying there's still more to internally process and work through. They got a lot going on internally, that is for sure. That is for sure. Oh, goodness, 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 goodness. Refusal. Either refusal or denial of having to make having to do something. That's fascinating. Why though? Why? What is that? That's fascinating. It's almost like what they're saying is they don't want to... How do I... Jeez, jeez, jeez. It seems and feels as if they're not making a plan because they know that there is a decision here regarding commitment or dedication that they're still refusing to do. Unless this is them like refusing to open up conversation and talk and communicate to you about this. Like, hey, um, I've already emotionally checked out. And they're kind of like, well, I'll just leave the door open even though nothing going on. Not too sure. Not too sure. It's just out. It feels like outright refusal. Like either one, they're not ready to, or two, they're just refusing to make that decision regarding commitment. I don't know if this is regarding some sort of financial endeavor, what they want to do next, what their plans are for their future. That would that make sense. Their plans for the future. Um, kind of like, you know, the typical saying of you need to get a job or you need to work. And someone says, I know, I know, I know, but not yet. I'm not ready. Yeah. Okay. Whew. Um, mm, that's difficult. That is difficult. That is very difficult. For some reason, it's an energy of, they're showing me this emphasis on things that they hold, things that they carry, things that they keep close to them, either things that are close to the chest in a sense that they want to protect and take with them that they value, uh, whether it be money, plans, whatever this endeavor is, um, they, they're, they're showing it to me repeatedly. Like, kind of just carrying and taking what they have with them, but it's an energy of kind of taking what they have left with them, which is fascinating. Um, I don't exactly know what their overall vision or desire is that they want to create and manifest, because they're ultimately saying that they're coming up with a vision at the same time. This is in an energy of slight greed, slight greed. It's an energy of kind of money hungry, which makes sense, especially if things are very difficult. Um... Don't exactly know what their overall goal or aim is moving forward. They're kind of just saying, I'm choosing to stay put possibly for financial reasons or possible security reasons. In a sense, a living situation, not too sure, or just what they have left financially. Um, we'll see where this one goes. Goodbye.